I'm Jonathan Stone. I'm a nature reserve manager for plant life, covering nature reserves in the south and west of England. And today I'm at Jones Hill Farm in Herefordshire, which is a plant life nature reserve and is managed mainly for its wildflower rich hay meadows. 97% of all hay meadows in the UK have been lost since the 1930s and so remaining fragments like this at Jones Hill Farm are particularly important. They're a great resource of native wildflowers but also for the, the vast um, variety of other wildlife that they support, particularly insects, butterflies, moths and the whole food web that's associated with them. Plant Life have owned Jones Hill Farm Nature Reserve since 1997 and have been managing it in the same way ever since. There's been a long continuity of regular haymaking and grazing that's helped to spread wildflower seed around the site and we've seen fields that were um, relatively species poor back in 1997 increased massively in the diversity of wild flora. This is the orchard area which has apple trees as well as damson and pear and it's really good for nesting birds and all sorts of invertebrates. We're over on the west side of the nature reserve now close to the woodland. The area we're in is a little bit less managed than the rest of the reserve whereas most of it is cut for hay in late summer. This area isn't cut, it just gets a little bit of cattle grazing late in the season. It has a different character and supports a whole host of moths, butterflies and other invertebrates. We're on the west side of the nature reserve in a slightly different area of habitat now and we have a wet flush running down the side of the hill and amongst the rushes here there are things like heath spotted orchid and a lovely display of ragged robin. This field is Herefordshire's coronation meadow and seed from here is regularly harvested and used to restore other meadows in the nearby area. The nature reserve is open to the public all year round and it's well worth visiting at any time of year and particularly in May and June um, when the flowers will be looking their best. And that concludes our tour of Jones Hill Farm. Thank you for joining me.